Hello, I'm Dr. Heidi Horsley, the Executive Director for the Open to Hope Foundation. And I'm here with a great friend of mine, Jason Stout from Outward Bound. Jason, tell us a little bit about how you got into this field and what exactly Outward Bound is. Well, I, I got in this field, um, I started working for Outward Bound in their admissions center. And I just thought it was a great job to have in Denver, but I fell in love with it right away. I fell in love with the mission, which is to inspire uh, personal growth through challenge. And uh, I've been working there for about 14 years. You know, Outward Bound is near and dear to my heart. Because when I was 20, my 17-year-old brother and cousin were killed together in a car accident. And my brother had just gone on Outward Bound and sung its praises, and he loved it. And so I decided three and a half months after his death to go on it, and it was absolutely life-changing. I literally did not know how I was going to survive after my brother died. And on Outward Bound, I not only found the will to live, I found passion and meaning in my own life again. So it is such an incredible program. What do you think that it does for people when they're on Outward Bound? Well, Outward Bound is a challenging experience. It takes us out of our comfort zone. We, we do these outdoor expeditions like canoeing, rafting, backpacking, mountaineering, sailing. We're doing this out away from our, our family and our friends. These are challenging programs. Our instructors are, are trained to provide a challenge, but also to provide enough challenge where we move out of our comfort zone and we discover who we are, but that we succeed as well. And, and I want to say to everybody listening out there, you do not have to be a mountain man or a mountain woman to do this. I had never camped. I hadn't hiked. I was not that kind of person. And I got so much out of going on Outward Bound. And Jason, can you tell us a little bit about Heroic Journeys? Right. Right. Well, this program that we have is Outward Bound for Grieving Teens. Uh, it's good to know that Outward Bound provides programs and expeditions that are seven days to 85 days for teenagers, for young adults, for adults. We serve about a thousand veterans per year. But Heroic Journey is what we used to call Outward Bound for Grieving Teens. We changed the name this year. But it's a seven day expedition that focuses on grief, that gives the, the students who are grieving the death of a loved one the space to grieve in the outdoors. And we do things like we will climb a mountain and we'll dedicate it to the person that died. Yeah. So there's a lot of ritual. There's a lot of ritual, there's a lot of ceremony, but what I tell the participants, participants as they're coming in or when they're considering this program is that it's 90% outward bound and 10% grief support activities because I think a fear for some kids that are looking at this program is will I be sitting around talking about my grief every day and be sad every day? But that's, that's not how it is. We're actually having a lot of fun. You're meeting these great friends who have gone through a challenge like yourself. You're outdoors, you're hiking, you're seeing beautiful places. And then, yeah, sometimes we're doing these fun rituals and ceremonies that connect us with our grief, that give us that space to share. And, you know, at night you often get, you know, gather around and you, you hear life lessons. And I remember something that I still, a mantra that I still use today by someone named Joseph Campbell who was a philosopher and, and he said, we must be willing to give up the life that we have planned so that we can embrace the life that is waiting for us. And that was one of the takeaways from Outward Bound for me. You know, this is my, the next chapter of my life and it taught me to push through adversity and it taught me to honor and celebrate my brother's life by living my best life. Well, we have a saying at Outward Bound that we, we don't teach for the mountains, meaning teaching just the skills to climb a mountain, but we teach through the mountains. It's what do we learn about ourselves when we're out sailing in a boat with a crew of 11 other people for seven days, or if we're canoeing, or if we're climbing mountains. What we're, really not, we're not really there just to learn about our surrounding, we're, learn, we're there to learn about ourselves. And, and Outward Bound is, a lot of people don't know this, but it's the nautical term for leaving the safety of harbor. And it's just so fitting for a program like this. Because you're going out of your comfort zone and challenging yourself. Yeah, a lot of us when we're grieving, we, we get stuck in our grief because we don't have that place to really move into our grief. We don't have a culture that allows that. But here you go on this seven day expedition, you're going outward bound. You're leaving the comfort of this place at home to go out and learn about yourself, to be vulnerable, to share things about yourself you don't share at home. You're going outward bound. 
And you, you can take off the mask and you don't have to take care of your family members who are often grieving as well. You can just go there and do something for yourself during this time. So I think it is a power, power, powerful program. And like I said, it, it was life changing for me. And so Jason, if those watching this video would like to find out more about Outward Bound, how do they get a hold of you? Uh, they, they can just go on our website. Outward Bound has a page that's the Grieving Teens page. Uh, you can uh, pop on the website. You can also call the phone number that's on the website and, and someone will answer that phone that knows all about this program. Wonderful. Thank you so much, Jason. Thank you for all the work you're doing. Like I said, my entire family has gone on Outward Bound and it is absolutely life changing. Thanks a lot, Jason. And this is Dr. Heidi Horsley from the Open to Hope Foundation.